So in this video clip I'm going to take um, take you uh, to the line in the in the King's engine with um, E takes D4. It's not uh, like a, a main line, but you see it um, uh, happen quite often, especially in uh, in in blitz games, and it's not an easy line to crack. But I had an interesting uh, game with um, Shakira Mamdiyev, and uh, I managed to outplay him in, an, in a nice way. This game was played in uh, in Corsica in 2010, and. Um, We played a match, and he had won the first game, so I really had to. So he and I really had to win this game, of course. And he was trying to play some kind of a solid line. Rook e8, f3. Yeah, basically here Black has uh, two ways of uh, playing. One is just to play uh, c6. It's kind of and trying to push d5 and um, but uh, normally white is uh, able to um, to defend himself against uh, this move d5 well white is first of all playing king h1 just to avoid all kind of tricks on the on this diagonal and one of the ideas is, for example, that if uh, white black is playing, for example, move like d5. Now, uh, first of all, in, uh, white has now two options. One is like to go e takes d5, c takes d5, and c5. Since white has this this very nice knight on d5, and uh, he is kind of, uh, this knight is in, in full control and, well, black looks a bit stupid with this pawn now on d5. This is one way to play for white. Another way is after d5, you can take with c pawn, pawn takes, and for example a move like bishop g5. And okay, it's a bit unpleasant the spin, and if, if black is taking on e4, it will be knight takes e4, and there will be some pressure. Anyway, uh, in general, uh, white can manage to um, to prevent black from playing this move uh, d5. So it means that if white can simply then consolidate by, let's say, playing bishop g5, queen d2, putting the rooks on. Uh, let's say C, C1 and D1 and he wants to put pressure finally on, on the move on the pawn D6 White has space advantage so that's why this line is not so popular for black Mom Yavi played a bit more active move trying to force uh, uh, things he plays here move knight C6 he defend our knight, knight f h5, queen d2, and and now he plays this move, knight f4. Actually, black has some more options. One of them is move like f5. I think it's not such a great move, but just to show you the trick which is if white takes on c6, b takes c6, if white takes on f5, now black can take on c3. And after move like for example queen takes c3, there's queen e7 with the pin there. And so it's if king f2, 
queen h4 check. King has to go back and queen e7. 